How's it going guys? And in this video, we're going to be walking through how you can calculate the R squared value after you fit a trend line to your data in Python. And so building off what we've done last time where we have these two lists and we've plotted this array, uh, I will just run this program real quick so we can see what it looks like. But the gist is that we end up with a trend line that is linear and we're trying to see how well our observed data fits this trend line. And to do that, we're going to want to find an R squared value. And so the way we can find this R squared value is by the following. So we will need to import from sklearn an additional package, and it's from sklearn.metrics, and we're going to import a class referred to as R2 score. And so this R2 score class, we can then invoke after we've successfully fit a trend line to our data, or we have an observed and an actual, uh, or an observed and a predicted uh, data set. And so in our case, what we can do to actually calculate the R squared value, and I'll just call this R squared, will be the following. So we will just say R squared is equal to R2 score, and then open parentheses, and now you will pass in the two lists or the two arrays that contain the data. The first of which will be your observed data, which in this case was just called Y. And then the second parameter here will be the predicted or expected behavior. And in that case, uh, this is what I'm calling trend line. And it's very important that you get them in this order because it is not symmetric, which means you can't fl flip it. If you flip it, you'll get different data. Um, so now that we've put in this, I will rerun this program. And if we look at the R squared value, once this thing finishes up uh, running, we can see that the R squared value here is equal to 0 0.87. Um, and so that's how fast and easy it is to calculate the R squared's value once you have your two arrays of the observed and the expected data. And that is going to wrap things up for this video. I hope it helps. Thank you all for watching and take care.